Good morning, it's Jackie White from Your Castle Real Estate. Hope you had a nice Valentine's Day. Don't forget, all of the chocolate is half price right now, so go stock up on some heart-shaped chocolate. Tastes good no matter if it's Valentine's Day or not. Anyways, I um, just want to tell you about my day yesterday. We had our annual meeting for Your Castle Real Estate. We did it over at the PPA Event Center, which is next to the Bronco Stadium. Had over 500 brokers from our company. Just a lot of great information. Um, we had a speaker from Zillow, learned a lot about some new um, technology that they're employing and how I can help my sellers get their listings at the top of the page when people are searching for homes. Um, also learned about the trends from 2016. Um, just some great information. I'm going to share a little tidbit with you. And then we had recognition. So um, we had a lot of awards that were given out. We've got some really top-notch agents at our company. And I was really um, just excited that I got two awards actually. One uh, is the Platinum Club Award that I got and this has to do with um, volume of business that I did last year for my clients for buyers and sellers. Um, this really just puts me in like the top 1% of agents so I was pretty psyched about that. Um, and I ended the year uh, number 14 on our company out of 500 agents so um, worked really hard and I really appreciate you know, all your referrals and your help and your uh, support in my business so thank you so much. And then I also got, um, for second year in a row, um, top agent, top second year. Um, so this is a recognition that was only given out to two people. So I was pretty psyched about that. So um, it was pretty nice to get the recognition. So, And I've got some big goals for this year. So if you know anybody that's buying or selling uh, real estate, would love to um, help them out. The one thing I do want to share is we always go through our annual trends um, report. And we have our new one that kind of closes out 2016. And I, a lot of people call and ask me and they think, gosh, we must be in a bubble. How can prices keep going up? And there's this one slide that is really pertinent to that and I really want to share it with you. So I'm going to try to do my best to do that on here. Um, but basically it's you know economics 101 and supply and demand. So let me just kind of get up here so hopefully you can see this well. So you'll see that um, this number here represents the number of homes that have been on the market since uh, 2008. And you can see we had a lot of homes. A lot of that had to do with foreclosures, bank-owned properties that were on the market. And then we had uh, the number of homes that were selling. So you can see there's a little bit of seasonality. But basically, the, the space between here and here is your supply. So as we go down with time, we lose supply. We have, like, no inventory right now. And you can see over the last, basically, three years, it's, we're pretty much selling every house that comes on the market. And as long as we continue to have a strong economy in Denver, Lots of jobs, it's a desirable place to live for all the reasons, you know, you and I love it. Hiking, biking, snowshoeing, terrific weather, beautiful mountains. Um, and we have an inventory problem, which has to do with not enough trades, not enough new homes being sold. You know, the prices are gonna continue to go up and um, I just don't see it being a bubble, quite honestly. I wouldn't um, be helping investors buy properties um, every day and I wouldn't be looking at them myself if I didn't think that was true. And it's not something that's going to happen overnight either. We have so much inventory that we uh, need to put on the market that um, it's going to take a long time for us to get caught up. With 50,000 new people moving to Colorado every year and only putting out about 18,000 new units every year, we're just not keeping up. So um, if you're thinking of selling, it's great. You've seen a lot of appreciation. you got a lot of equity in your home now. If you're thinking of buying, just be prepared. you got to be competitive. But, you know, a third of my buyers are... Um, going under contract on properties before they ever hit the market. I actually closed one just yesterday in Conifer. Same thing. All has to do with, you know, networking and getting out there to find properties for my clients before they hit the MLS. So if you have questions, call me. I'm always here to be a resource. You can always reach me on my cell, 720-475-6111. Have a great week. I'll see you around. Bye.